Okay, Hans Messer from PetMini.com. We've got the um, Everett Mini here, 2009, and I have a 68,045 PSI tank, which was um, kindly lent for this test from one of the fine gentlemen at Atomic Paintball. We're very generous and um, help each other out if someone is missing a gear. You know, if someone's looking for a pod, somebody needs a squeezy, we're really um, good to help each other out. So check it out, AtomicPaintballLLC.com for information on the site and directions to the field. This Invert Mini is completely stock apart from, I have a Tech T Level 3 spring kit. I left my stock kit at home and I did a little bit of tuning with the pressure and the dwell on the board, which anybody can do. So we're going to see how many pods can this thing shoot on a 6845. All right, so we're on our way to the chrono. Got some air first. And the 6845 is usually used for the uh, efficiency test. Mike Phillips from Tech TV does them quite often. So I'm going to stick with his standards as much as I possibly can. So that's what, why I'm going to be using the 6845. I really want to use my 56 since it is an invert tank. So let's see if you can zoom in there. So we got about 4,000 PSI around there. Okay, so we're at the Chrono. We have, I believe, 13 or so pods set up with various paintballs. This is Vulcan Breach, which I've had since about early June. The green balls, a little bit of green balls there, are Vulcan Redemption, the higher end of Vulcan paint. And the standard practice paint for Atomic Paintball is DXS. DXS basic training. It works pretty well and shoots straight. So we're actually going to chrono the gun, check everything out, and then we're going to do our efficiency test. Shooting a little hot. I was shooting 250 all day. Okay, so I'm going to increase the velocity. It's pretty hot today, so um, we're also using the um, standard barrel, which is at a bore of 691. Load some more paint. No. I'm filling it up. So the field velocity at atomic paintball is 280 feet per second. But for the sake of the test, we're going to ramp this up to about two, um, 295 to 300, just like Mike does in his test. So we have a pretty good speed. Okay, so I'm going to pick up the camera, hand this off, and we're going to start the test. So now we have our first pod loaded, and we're just going to start. Are you ready? Ready? Yep. Give me one second. Like.
think we're running low on pressure. Yeah, we were. Yeah, it started freezing. Yeah, we're running low. So the pressure's dropped out. So, so let's positive. see how many pods did we get through. We got through one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh boy, nine. 10, 11 pods on the Invert Mini with a 50, uh, with a 6845 filled to about 4,000 PSI. The Invert Mini is a very efficient gun with its pressure control poppet technology, revolutionizing the way that paintball guns fire and operate. And it's very good. So we dropped a little bit of paintball, that's maybe a quarter pot or so. And um, this wasn't, this wasn't as, well pulled off as Mike from Tech BB's uh, efficiency test, but now you actually know how much um, a Invert Mini gets from um, a decent sized tank with a decent fill. So everything's good that way. So, what do you think about the Mini? You shot it the whole time? Yeah, um, I'm not a Mini owner, but soon to be Mini owner. Um, the Mini um, is a very good quality gun. You can trust it for pretty much anything. Um, Personally, I think it's just as good as an ego. That you may think different, but I think that. Um, so, did it kick too much, or the kicking was like a normal gun? Just kick, it, every gun's pretty much going to kick, and unless it's like a crap gun, and um, um, everything else seems to be pretty good. Um, um this is me, Michael Drotty, or Mike Beast Boy at PitMini.com. Can you dig it? So, Brandon, what do you think about the Invert Mini? Of course, all you did was load it, but how did everything go? I like it a lot. I played with it in a game or two and it was amazing. I bought this one at Zephyr Paintball but you can also go to the Invert Mini website and purchase it directly from Key Action Sports. There are a lot of people who are asking uh, should I buy a pre-owned Mini, should I buy a new Mini, um, what version is which and you can't go wrong with buying it directly from Key. So in the rare rare case that they ship out a lemon of course you've got the um, tech support and Key is very very good at satisfying their customers so just give them a call if you have um, if you're an existing mini owner and you're having problems just give them a call if you're a new owner and it gets out the box and it's not working exactly like you want it give them a call they'll be able to walk you through stuff and even in you know worst case scenario you have to ship your gun in um, they're gonna have it turned around and back on your way so you're probably not gonna be missing a practice at all this is Metric Bernard from pimpmini.com Check out our sponsors, uh, Invert and Tech T Paintball, as well as Cohen Sports. They're the ones got. They're the guys who are hooking us up. You know, giving us giving us some stuff, and they'll help me allow you to bring you these cool videos.